Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I am here with the first impression first impression again. I think you already have seen my super long get ready with me when I just babble and babble and babble so I'm going to try to make this short. So today we are going to use the good sport palette from Colourpop and yes I bought this one. I think I talked about this in one of my will I buy it videos and said that I am not going to buy this uh, but I did and it looks like this. So I think I know what I want to do. I have swatched a little bit and I think I'm going to do a halo eye. I do a lot of halo eyes right now. I know that. Or maybe I shouldn't do a halo eye then. No, I, I think I know. I, I'm not going to do a halo eye. I think. We will see. I want to do use two colors. I want to use all the colors. But um, I have been so interested to use this ebb and also this hooky. Uh, this hooky was maybe not <laughs> surprising for you but maybe this ebb was a little bit surprising for you. So I don't know if I'm going to do a halo eye or if I'm going to do something else. I think I will do uh, something else. Um, or maybe halo eye. I, I do a halo eye. That was my first thought so we do a halo eye. Okay, I've changed my mind. I am not going to do a halo eye. So I think I will start with this high hopes and put it in my crease. Um, so yes. So I have used some ColourPop um, palettes. I. Okay, this was pretty dark. It was darker than I expected. And I think they are good, but they are very... Um, um. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was a lot. I think some of the shades aren't so... How can this be so freaking dark? How? Did I take the right color? Maybe I didn't. Maybe that's the problem. I think I took the wrong color. We'll see on the next time. Um, okay, I don't even know what I was talking about. My brain... <laughs> Brain has been a little slow when I've been sick. Okay, so if this was high hopes, this was so dark. It is high hopes. It is this color and it's this dark. I really don't like that. It is a nice color. I think I maybe accidentally took okay on the other eye okay so this is either high hopes only high hopes or high hopes and hooky i don't know but i like this color it was just a little darker than i expected it to be maybe it is my eyeshadow base but usually it doesn't go like this uh, it, this doesn't happen. Okay, so now I will take Hooky, this one, this one, and put it out here and almost the whole way in. And now we will see if I took the wrong color here or not. And I think I did. Okay, I did wrong on this. I, I think I took Hooky um, because this did blend better together than this one. Oh. Okay, I should not film when I am this slow in my head. And I'm so afraid that I'm going to have fallouts because as you can see I have already done my base and I don't want to do it again. Uh, I will also take this underneath my eyes. And I will test a new brush. I have bought my first brush from Makeup Geek. 
and this is Outer V brush and I'm going to try to use it underneath my eyes and I hope I pray for no fallouts but this was so so easy to work with this color I have no fallouts whatsoever and it is so pigmented and so nice and now Okay, this is maybe one of my new favorite brushes. This was amazing. Okay, so for the little more fun part, I'm going to take Ebb and I'm going to take it in here and also down here and in my inner corners. And this color, I hope I don't get any fallouts. First when I saw this palette, I was like, that's nothing for me. But then I think it was Paulina that did the first impression with this and she used this ebb. I think it was her at least. And I was like, I need that in my life. Uh, she is responsible for so many palettes that I have in my collection. And right now I am so glad that she is. And I think that also Anjelka Nyqvist, Anjelka Nyqvist, Anjelka Nyqvist love this palette or likes this palette and I start to see why because this is so good. And I am really impressed with Colourpop's shadows. They are so good with doing these glitter. This is so easy. It is like pigmentation and Opacity at once. It's opaque. Is it opacity? It's the sick brain that is talking. Okay, I'm sorry for being so off in this video. Um, <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to act. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, I hope it is okay. So uh, I'm going to take Ebb also here on my lower lash line. Take this and I'm going to spray it and I I don't like spraying. And this... Uh, I just don't so... Yeah. But I don't want fallout. So I'm going to put this on my lower lash line as well. I have cat hair. Okay, this was even more amazing when it is sprayed. This feel like some kind of sorcery. Color pop. And I am so impressed when cheaper brands or more in inexpensive brands can do colors like this and like expensive brands can't. Then I like what is what is it that is so hard for you? Okay, so I don't know how this turned out. I thought I was going to like this shadow, but not this much. I really love it, and it's such a good shade. And I now I am so intrigued to use like this as well. But this ebb, I have nothing like this in my collection. This is a really really nice. I maybe went a little bit overboard, but I think we can live with this. So I'm going to put on some mascara and also something in my waterline. I don't know what, um, I don't know what's going to be cool with this. Something colorful at least, I think. Um, 
I have to check a little bit. So I will come back with the finished look and I will also put on some lipstick on my dry lips. So I will be back with, with the finished look. So this is the finished look. For my waterline I used Ori Flash from Linda Holberg and on my lips I used NYX Liquid Suede Soft Spoken. This is one of my all time favorite lipsticks liquid lipsticks and also favorite color so this is the look with the good sport from Colourpop and the colors I have used this is a very easy fast and simple makeup that's the most things I do is easy fast and yeah um, but I really really like this this is amazing. I wish that they would come this as a single because it is such a unique color and it was so easy to work with and when I sprayed it it was even more amazing. So I really love this ebb and I think these two goes great together and I am so looking forward to use this uh, luscious. These are so creamy. It's like gold straight up gold um, and if it is like the ebb it's going to be amazing as well so I am so happy that I bought this one usually it is like that uh, when I see I have to take this away or else I will have gold everywhere um, first I maybe don't want the palette but then I start to see reviews from people that I trust and like and I like their makeup style and that <laughs> very often changed my mind about things so as with this one so yeah, I really like this look um, and it's going to be so fun to play with this palette and yeah the colors were wear was very easy to work with so I really like this one uh, so the first impression is good and I am glad that I changed my mind. So I really ho <laughs> so I really hope you like this video and I will try to be back on my normal schedule now. Hopefully this sickness will go away soon. So <clears throat> I am my normal self again because right now my brain feels a little bit mushy. Um, but I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos. So I'll see you in the next one. Bye!